How do you stop a 3000 degree inferno from melting your rocket engine? That's the challenge facing engines like the F1, the powerhouse of the Saturn V. Luckily, it had a brilliant solution. Imagine exhaust gases hotter than the surface of some stars, reaching over 3000 degrees Celsius. That's 5,400 degrees Fahrenheit. Without an incredible cooling system, the engine would simply melt itself into slag in seconds. The primary hero of this story is regenerative cooling. Instead of just letting the heat melt the engine, engineers designed the F1's combustion chamber and nozzle walls from hundreds of tiny, precision-engineered tubes. Through these tubes, the engine's own RP-1 kerosene fuel was continuously circulated before it was injected and burned. As the fuel traveled, it absorbed immense heat from the scorching walls, effectively cooling them down. And in a stroke of genius, this preheated fuel then became even more efficient when it was injected, boosting performance. It's like the engine was cooling itself with its own fuel. But that wasn't all. For the incredibly hot nozzle extension, another trick was used. Film cooling. Cooler exhaust gases from the turbo pump were intentionally bled into the nozzle, creating a thin, protective insulating film along the inner surface, shielding it from the extreme heat. And all of this was possible thanks to advanced material science. Those crucial cooling tubes were made from Inconel X750, a super tough, high temperature nickel chromium alloy built to withstand those unbelievable forces and temperatures. And that's the remarkable story of how the F1 engine mastered its own inferno, a testament to brilliant engineering. If you found this exploration of rocket science fascinating, please take a moment to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more science facts and F1 engine insights. Don't hesitate to share this with anyone who loves learning about incredible inventions. We'd also love to hear your thoughts or questions. Leave a comment below and let us know what other technical breakthroughs you'd like us to uncover. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.